welcome back to the channel guys in this video we are going to be doing step by step guide to update bios on a motherboard using m flash process in our case we have x570 motherboard but process should be very similar for other motherboard manufacturers but please follow manufacturer's guideline this means that it could damage your motherboard if done incorrectly so first of all navigate to the motherboard vendors website in our case we are using msi and find the exact motherboard you're using don't settle for close enough find the exact product like i said it can damage your motherboard if done incorrectly now go to the support of your motherboard then download the latest bios that's relevant to you you make sure you find the correct bios once you download the bios on your computer you must extract it and save the files on your USB drive and make sure you save it in the root of the USB drive. Leave the USB drive plugged into the system and reboot it. Press delete or whatever key required in your case to boot into the system BIOS. Navigate to the system information to find the current BIOS version. Make sure you take a note of it in case you need to roll back. Navigate to M flash. Select the USB device. Then select the BIOS file you extracted and save on the USB earlier. Once you select the new BIOS file, hit enter and system will prompt you with warning sign. Select yes and proceed. Do not shut down or reboot system during the BIOS update. Accept the prompt after review and allow the flash to continue. Do not interrupt this process. If it looks like there's no progress, be patient and walk away from it. Restarting now can damage something. Once BIOS update is complete, system will reboot. Let the system fully reboot into the operating system. Once system fully reboot into the operating system, you can restart the system and get back into the BIOS following the earlier method. Once into the BIOS, please check the BIOS information. You should have new BIOS version. While in the BIOS, check your system configuration settings. In our case, our memory profile settings were set back to default. So we had to reapply correct settings and saved. Once all settings configured, saved and confirmed, you can exit the BIOS and let the system boot into the operating system again. Congratulations, you have successfully updated your motherboard BIOS.